this coach looked like when we bought it. We bought two of them. This is before, this one is after. So originally these two coaches and that locomotive up front ran commuter service in Montreal. The, lo the coaches went out to the west, you know, go see the ghost town and all that. The locomotive did its duty, went up for sale. Mr. Miles had bought these coaches already. The locomotive came up for sale later, he bought that. So here they are back together again in Homesdale. That's our other locomotive, that's good old 54. That's 19. 1949 Electromotive Division in General Motors. what way most of the people that are on the train goes and kind of follow them. What's up FOA squad? I'm Anthony and welcome to our channel Life with Anthony. I hope you guys are doing well out there. I am at the Harley's flea market here in Harley's, Pennsylvania. I took the train ride here as you guys saw. I'm now walking around and checking out all the vendors here as well as the park and anything else that there is to explore in this area. So come on and let's enjoy this seemingly beautiful day out today and just kind of hang out and see what's around these parts. I got some peaches, which I probably will buy. <clears throat> oh, look at these onions. Everything looks so nice and fresh. I am. I'm a huge fan. Oh my gosh. I saw you. I was driving to work. I was like, I swear that's him. Oh my God. This is How you doing? Good. Great to meet you. Likewise. I watch all your thank videos. You. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. What's your name? I'm Seth. Seth. Yeah. Nice to meet Great you, Seth. To meet you. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> I swore it was you. I stopped. I was like, I'm going to be late to work. Yes, it's it. me. Awesome. Hey, thanks for the support. Thank yeah. you. Thank yeah. you for the we'll support. See you next time. All right. Hey, Excuse me. I Wasn't that neat? <laughs> Who would have thought that I would have met someone here <laughs> in Holly? <laughs> look at this little buggy right here. Oh, look at that. And they have all kinds of little knickknacks and stuff. Look at this little buggy. Oh my goodness. And here's the ice cream place. Oh 
homemade pierogies and soup. Cloths. Not cloths, but you know. I know, I have a bunch of them. But I Sausages and cheese. Hmm. Oh my god, look at these beautiful hand carved bowls. Wow, sir, they look so nice. Look at that bowl. Oh my goodness, I think I'm gonna get one of these bowls. Vegetables. The vegetables look so fresh. Lord, I think I need to get some more money. It's pretty. We got one of these. Thank you. How much is those? Those are twenty. These are twenty-eight. Yes, I do. And they're 35. Look at my spare time. Must have a lot of spare time. They are so, they are so nice. I'm going to get one of these bowls. No, no, these are 13, those are 18. You can eat out of these bowls? Sure. Yep. Everything I coat them with is food safe. Okay. Yep. I'll have this one. That one? Good. Thank you. Thank you. These are gorgeous. They're charcuterie. Yes. You know, Jimmy, you don't have a napkin holder. Here you go, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy. Man, I love this bowl. It is so colorful and beautiful and well done. I think I'm going to get some of these peaches here, too. I'm not sure. Cause y'all know I got dentures and turn on. I, I have to think about my eating yeah. process. <laughs> I, I might have to cut them in half. Maybe I'll get them and try to make a peach pie. Ooh, that sounds good. I'll think about it <laughs> before I leave the area.
I had to pay for my McDonald's food this morning with cash. I usually use my I usually use my phone, but no, I use the cash, and now I'm running out of cash here. So I'm just gonna do a little bit of walking and see if I can find a bank machine, and then I'll probably walk back down that way because I'm thinking about getting some of those peaches because I think they will be good. Everything there looks so fresh. That's the thing about farmer's market stuff. The food that they sell there is so fresh looking. And I'm gonna try me some things. I might get me some of those herbs and stuff as well, if I can get some more money somewhere. Okay, I am now walking in the opposite direction of the flea market. <clears throat> Not the flea market, the um, farmer's market. There's a train right there. There's an information center right there as well. That's cool. That's nice. Also coming up on the Holly Public Library. protection project. I almost said food protection. <laughs> yeah, it's a class B. Oh, here's the pizza place he was talking about on the train. Joe and Lorenzo restaurant and pizzeria. Huh. I might stop in and get a slice of pizza. He said that he said that he might be coming here himself and get a slice of pizza. This is a quaint little town here. Doesn't look like it's open. <laughs> Warm beer voted lousy food, worst food. <laughs> look at this little area right here that they have turned into a seating area. Crazy comedy night. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Look at that building. It's a bank. Okay. That's the Holly Bank. 
this down here. <clears throat> this look like a a theater. Not like a movie theater, but like plays and stuff. Ritz. Something rotten musical. Now, see, that would have been nice if this would have been included in the train ride. If we could see a show as well. That would have been nice. Company Playhouse. 50 years. 1973. That's 2023. How about that? I would have loved to see one of these plays from here. They should try to work that out though. Something I have been had in a long time True love crime, my hope you know that It may hurt for a while Let's slow down, slow down I can see behind that broken smile Nice, sweet, smooth Like Coco Bray, Coco Bray All right, guys, I'm almost back at the uh, park where the uh, farmer's market is. But before, I, be, but before I get to where all the people are, <clears throat> I wanted to talk about my pizza experience at Joe and Lorenzo's Pizza. The pizza was okay, because y'all know I'm a pizza lover. Pizza is in my top three 
foods that I really like. And the pizza was okay. The best part was the bottom of the pizza. I liked the crunch that it had. Now here's the part that I did not like at all. I gave the woman a $20 bill to pay for my food. And instead of her putting my change in my hand, she put it on the countertop and I had to pick it up. I don't like that. I think that's bad business. You know, if I handed it to you in your hand, you can at least have the courtesy to put it back in my hand. So she did that and I just was kind of like, ugh. You know, it put a little sour taste in my mouth, but the pizza was just okay. I've had many, many pizza that was a lot better tasting than that. Now let me go get me some peaches. Oh my goodness, y'all, I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, I gotta take a pee pee. I might have to find a tree, but I stopped and got me some two scoops of butter pecan ice cream. It is so delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my goodness. This is really good. <clears throat> and this was just $3.50 <clears throat> for two scoops. Try getting that at um, Cold Stone. You be paying like eight bucks. Oh, this is so good. Oh, he took the um. <laughs> I bought some peaches. And look at that one. That ain't no good. <laughs> That's no good. Let me inspect these peaches. Because I got one bad one. Look at this little baby one. <laughs> I guess I can cut that section off. And he didn't even give me the um the little basket container that they were in. Ooh. He didn't even give me the little basket container that it was in. He dumped the peaches out. I guess he recycling. They have a bathroom on a train. So I'm gonna have to use that. I see these little, these little black ants. Mm, Anthony, what are you doing? I'm slobbering all over the place. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Mm. I'm trying to eat this before it melts. All right. I'm getting some underneath this tree. Okay. The last thing I need is some, some black ants to get in my peach bag and start eating my peaches up. I'll see you guys back at the train station. <laughs> that looked like so much fun.
right guys that's gonna do it for today's video as always thanks for taking a few minutes out of your day to watch my videos i appreciate you guys you know that and i'll see you guys the next time